Hi loves, happy Tuesday. I hope that all is well. Today is Talk With Thai Tuesday and for today's topic, we're going to be talking about how to build discipline. So if you find that you struggle with sticking to certain habits or just setting goals for yourself, discipline is really going to help you to overcome obstacles. It's going to help you to be consistent in whatever you do, be procrastination and addiction if you have any, and really just help you to achieve the things that you want. So I'm going to give some tips on things that's helped me. So if you're interested, let's get into it. So the first thing that you want to do if you're looking to start building discipline is identify your negative habits. So what are the habits that are stopping you from achieving the things that you want? Is it maybe that you watch too much TV or that you don't eat healthy enough to maintain a certain level of energy? Or do you just have negative habits that kind of bring you back to a bad environment or place? So once you identify those negative habits that you are looking to get rid of, start writing a list of things that you want to incorporate in replace of those negative habits. Now this new list of healthy habits that you're going to create is going to be kind of like a roadmap to the things that you want to achieve. It's going to help you to build discipline and get clear about what it is that you want. So once you have your new healthy habits set in place, the next thing that you want to do is set goals. Now your goals can also have to do with your healthy habits that you're trying to implement. So say one of your goals is to start beating procrastination and that's a habit that you want to get rid of. A goal for you might look like setting tasks for yourself throughout the day. This really helps me as well because sometimes I have so much to do that I get overwhelmed and then it causes you to start slacking. It causes you to kind of just not really get any tasks done at all. So make sure that you're setting tasks for yourself throughout the day. So you're setting daily goals so that you can follow a list of things that you have to get done. This really helps you to be more efficient, more productive, and it also helps you to start beating procrastination. Another thing that's really important is to find your motivation and your sense of why you want to do something. This is what's going to keep you going despite when you see progress or when you don't see progress or when you feel like you want to give up or you feel like things aren't really working out for you. Your why is going to be what's going to push you and motivate you to keep going. The thing about discipline and why it's so good as well is because we're not always going to be motivated. We're not always going to feel like doing things and that's why discipline comes in because regardless of your emotions and how you feel Feel, it helps you to really just push past that and to continue to work towards the things that you want. Now, I personally also do believe in taking breaks. I don't feel like we should just be working ourselves to death or, you know, disregarding our mental, spiritual and emotional health. But there are times when sometimes we get lazy and we just don't feel like doing something when we know that we can push ourselves to do it. This is when discipline comes in. Once you have discipline and you really learn to build that, Literally nothing can get in the way of the things that you want to achieve because regardless of what happens in your life, regardless of what you're lacking, regardless of what you don't have, regardless of the situations that arise, it's going to be easier for you to overcome it and to push past it because you have that self-discipline. It's a really important thing to build, honestly, especially if you know that you're somebody that you want to strive for great things or you just want to be the best version of yourself. Building discipline is really going to help you to achieve that and to become that best version. Now, something else that I like to do is I like to write down my goals because it makes it a lot more tangible. And not only that, but it helps you to keep track and progress of what your accomplishments are. And once you start seeing that you're building those healthy habits and you're starting to see that you're accomplishing a lot of the things that you set out to do, this encourages you to keep going and it encourages you to want to continue down that same path. This is really going to help you too when it comes to the whole motivational aspect and just staying up and positive along your path because once you really start to see the progress that you're making, it's going to help you to feel better about what you're doing, what you're accomplishing and where you're going, which is going to keep giving you that motivation at the end of the day. So that is all. I just wanted to do a quick little chat about some ways that you could start building your discipline. At the end of the day, it really just comes down to the consistency in your habits and you having to put in the work. So that's it for this video. If you enjoyed, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe, send it to somebody that you feel may need to hear it. And I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out.